the importance of peace in our lives. Peace, in its broad sense, does not only mean the elimination of conflict and disagreement, but it can require the establishment of a set of vocabulary values, attitudes, and customs that are based on full respect for the principles of sovereignty, fundamental freedoms and human rights dialogue and cooperation between multiple peoples and cultures, and the rejection of the culture of force and its use and coercion. People make choices against their will. That peace must be granted to the people so that it can be obtained as a general condition. Since peace is a blessing for humanity, violence and wars are a curse, and since peace is love and coexistence, then wars are hostility and division. Wars the opposite of peace wars and conflicts throughout time have exhausted all the peoples of the earth. Today everyone aspires to peace that responds to their hopes and wishes and provides them with a prosperous life without fear of missiles of all kinds, bullets, bombs, or nuclear weapons. These things frighten adults, destroy children's childhood, and destroy facilities, civilizations, and the historical legacy of nations. The peoples of all the world were striving to achieve the great goal that everyone aspires to and which was founded and supported by all heavenly religions throughout time. They all called for love, mercy, brotherhood, affection, and building a common future among all peoples, races, and races— Peace is a name that God has attributed to him among his most beautiful names. It is the greeting of Muslims and the call to all prophets. It is what is called upon after completing the prayer as if it were a commandment revealed by God for the earth, so that people can believe in it and imitate it. The importance of peace in an individual's life, the role that peace, reconciliation, and mercy play in daily life can never be neglected. Man was created to live in peace, security, and reassurance, and was not created to be killed and annihilated. What can be achieved in times of peace is many times greater than what can be achieved in bloody conflicts, wars, and human disasters. The importance of peace in life can be summarized in the following points. The human race has a unique quality, which is to transform negative into positive. This quality can only be achieved with the psychological stability that peace achieves. The human brain is a treasure trove of infinite power. If he loses self-assurance in times of crises and wars, he will not benefit from his mental ability in a meaningful way, as wars and destruction are an obstacle in the path of human development, because it stops its causes of tranquility, tranquility and stability. When a person is able to maintain peace at all times, many possibilities open up before him. And this is what happens when a negative is transformed into a positive. The effects of peace pervade all beings. Peace is important for all living beings on the face of the earth, or in the space surrounding the earth, and its impact is not limited to humans alone. This is because the lack of peace and security and the spread of wars extend their impact, devastation and destruction to limits beyond what can be imagined. Animals are harmed and lose their homes and environments. Trees and vegetation that benefit both animals and humans are burned and resources are destroyed. The effects of wars and the lack of peace on the environment are divided into two parts. Direct effects such as environmental pollution, resulting from artillery shelling of industrial sites, the deliberate destruction of natural resources, military waste, and the debris of targeted infrastructure. Indirect effects, such as the environmental effects that the displaced leave behind, including devastation and pollutants, the collapse of the administrative system that plans to preserve the environment, and the preoccupation of people and governments after wars with shelter feeding and reconstruction. So all funding goes to these ends, and there is no funding to protect the environment. Peace protects a person from disease. The lack of peace and security causes a number of psychological disorders and diseases for individuals, and these psychological diseases may lead to physical diseases and spread among many people. And this is what became clear and happened to the peoples participating in the First and Second World Wars. The numbers of people suffering from depression, hysteria, phobia, schizophrenia, anxiety, and heart and stomach diseases are increasing. Here are some other points that show the importance of peace in life. 
Through peace, a person can spread his ideas that may have been extinguished during wars of violence and destruction, or at least distorted. For this reason, the messenger of God, Muhammad, may blessings and peace be upon him. And despite the difficulty of the conditions that the infidels imposed on the Muslims in the Treaty of Hudaybiyah, he accepted them, in exchange for maintaining a ten-year truce between Muslims and the infidels of Mecca, peace enables people to learn, acquire, and spread culture, build civilizations, and advance the state economically and socially. Construction only takes place in times of peace and security. Peace makes people aware enough of the danger of entering into wars and being preoccupied with them, their requirements and their impact on them, which will cost them their lives in exchange for this human arrogance. Peace is what clears the way for war merchants who would have an interest in creating and igniting wars and who want to continue them for a long time in order to increase their profits from weapons and ammunition and thus increase their profits and greed. Consider these passages that suggest peace and love between peoples.